What is up guys, welcome back to a new video and I apologize right away for my absence in the last few days. I've actually been quite busy, I've been traveling around Italy. I've actually moved to the south for a few days because my cousin had a pretty big ceremony as his first son was actually born. So I just went there to be present. My luck turns out that I actually left my hard disk there when I used to actually record and save content. So I was actually pretty stuck as my Mac is pretty small on internal memory. Yes, but I'm back now, I've received my, uh, my hard disk today actually and and um, it is the end of the King of the Hill event and we actually placed 6th, which is not our standard thing. I actually got 92% progress. I should have gotten the whole 25, but um, I so could have gotten those 500 sigils and it really pisses me off that I didn't. But you know, moving forward. Lately, I've actually gotten to the golden evolution stone for Snowdrop, just to keep you guys informed. I'm not far away from the platinum. I think I'm probably going to be able to get it this uh, fortification event. And yes, it is fortification if you guys didn't know. You should follow me on Twitter at istefawd to know all the upcoming events days early uh, so that you can actually prepare. So I'll just hold on to your wood at the moment. Not in that sense. I mean your lumber. I would hold on to that. You know, keep it up for the, I think it it will start Wednesday night for European time. It'll probably be in the afternoon for the US time. I've actually started to believe that Tengu was a dragon to have because I am pretty short on good sorcerers. Obviously, I've, I've gotten both Vulcan and Kelvin in my pocket at the moment, but they're not really Sapphire level. Last time I had Season Dragons, I went for Nightshade and for Scar, so I left Ebon now. And this time around, I'm also going again for the Warrior and the Hunter. I hope for the best and i hope that i can get all three but i don't think so because i they really decrease the drops on sigils they really have decreased the drops on them and they've actually placed other stuff that you know we really don't care about like uh plus 30 percent hp on your base plus 30 percent attack on your base like that kind of stuff we don't really we don't really care you shouldn't put that in gold chests you know, especially during events. But hopefully in this fortification event, I'm actually going to open a few chests as well. As you can see, I have 7.4k saved. I didn't spend them in the last event because there was really no point as I was already coming to the end of the event. But hopefully this time around, I can max out fortification again. It'll be pretty tough, but uh, I'll try my best to actually accomplish that. I believe breeding event is the hardest one to actually finish off. But I had an announcement for you guys as well. So you should really, really hear me out on this. I will actually start doing giveaways, obviously in-game content giveaways for all dragons. You should look out for that. And obviously to win giveaways, you have to be subscribed to my channel and you have to drop a like probably there's going to be other ways to enter the uh, the giveaway in, in some sort of way but uh, we'll actually talk about this in depth as i actually start hitting the 500 subs but uh you know i just thought you, I, I thought i should prepare you on this as people go crazy and mental for giveaways i actually used to go mental for giveaways as well when uh, when this game started out and um when Pixel was doing her live streams. Never got to win anything, but uh, that's okay. You know, participating is good, but some will have to win it at some point. So uh, you should definitely keep an eye out for that. Well, obviously my snowdrop is gold level. And uh, with these season dragons, I don't know if you probably, you probably have noticed, uh, when they actually hit the gold evolution, uh, they don't hit it at level 11, like the other two, as this goes all the way to level 45, not 30. They actually hit it at level 13. And when they move on to the gold evolution, they actually don't acquire a lot of stats increase. They actually go up by 30k or something. The actual increase is after that. It's literally at level th from level 13 going to level 14. That's when the big jump actually hits in. And this is actually the phase of my snowdrop where every level is roughly a 200k 300k increase this is good times to have a dragon of this sort and uh, i'm actually trying to get him to level 21 as soon as i can that's where a trend is at at the moment yes as you can see he actually goes up 241k uh, with one level and he's probably going to go up even higher than that in, uh, in a few more levels uh, my Kelvin and Vul can actually go up 500k roughly each from level 8 to level 9 as they unlock Spell Flux, both of them. Yes, uh, my Sigurd is actually done. He's come to a maximum uh, as I don't have the Platinum Stone for him. I believe I only went to the Gold. That's the only 
a stone I, I, I got to uh, would sing it. I didn't go full hard and I was pretty young at that time, so to say. I was very um, inexperienced and didn't know how to actually get the best out of events. Yes, so that's why I'm a bit behind. He's actually gone to the maximum that I could I could do with him. Tarand obviously is going to go all the way to uh, Garnet. Uh, Nightshade is going to go all the way to Sapphire and Scar is going to go all the way to Sapphire. Jagra and Kulan actually are of no use to be honest because they've already gotten to this to this pretty good point where they're breedable. As I said, I was going to get both Kaiju and Rizzer at the same time and to do so I need Kulan and Jagra. As you can see right there, uh, this is Rizzer right here with 229 out of 400 fragments and this is kaiju with zero out of 400 as i haven't even started so uh, we'll wait for the next breeding event for that and yes so this is my, my announcement for now guys i uh, hope you guys actually enjoyed it do stay tuned for that giveaway be sure to hold on to your lumber as fortification is coming i don't know if you guys saw this but recently i actually got the war dragons ice mage aurora uh, t-shirt uh, i'm actually gonna pop a link down in the description if you guys want that and if you're gonna buy it anytime on the war dragon store here's a picture of me wearing it i posted it on twitter and as always guys take care peace out